So exploration for me is the satisfaction of my inherent curiosities and the potential of having unexpected experiences in the vast and remote frontiers of the world. Man is born curious. He is born to explore. He started with climbing trees, going deep into caves, climbing up mountains. Not satisfied with this, he started building boats to cross the rivers and the seas, build submarines to dive into the depths of the ocean and build airplanes to explore the skies. Now he is exploring the stars. So for me, exploration is inherent in me as a human being and something that I will continuously keep doing. So here at DCP, we give you the opportunity to satisfy your own innate curiosities and your exploration desires. <clears throat> Go up to a rock, climb up a mountain, hike some unfamiliar trails, mingle with the tribals, partake of some of those festivals, eat the local cuisine and get to know what there is in some of those last frontiers that remain for us. Well, at uh, DCP Explorers, we will be clubbing together. Its present verticals of wildlife, nature, travel, food, photography into one seamless experience for its participants. And while doing so, we will be aiming to give a very unique experience at very offbeat destinations to our participants. An example comes to mind of what you may expect is like visiting Sibuyan with us, one of the most remote islands of the Philippines itself and also known as the Galapagos of the East. You may expect the details in the future very shortly. Well, it's going to be very exciting. We are meticulous when it comes to the details and triple check everything for accuracy and safety. We secure only the very best in every region, be it your food, accommodation or travel. Since we've been there, now we are a single window, we take care of all these correspondence and uh, logistics and payment hassles as well as give you a seamless experience in terms of language, your local transport and support. The world is today a, a small place what with GPS and uh, uh, information available of the net. You always have the option of going on your own. However, you are entering unfamiliar terrain. You will have probably issues with the language, the banking, the payment methodologies, the food. Uh, most importantly, sometimes the food because you don't know what's available there. This year, we're firming up our plans and you can expect to go to some of the remotest islands which are opening recently, countries which have been inaccessible until now because of civil strife and which is just about getting peaceful. You can expect to go to great archipelagos, some islands with endemism, great cultures which are until now not very exposed. These are some of the things you can expect in your travels. Um, wait for the details which will be soon announced.